Hello, this is Stuart once again. I'm, what I'm showing here is a picture of a very, very heavily thatched yard. I have just ripped this right on down here using a flail blade thatching machine. That's a type I use. And I think it's a PR-22, a Bluebird is what I'm using here. And um, I've got multiple machines. And But I, d I just wanted to show you and um, how heavily, you can see in the footprints and all that sort of stuff, um, how heavily this has been thatched. This, this yard has drainage issues back here. It has deciduous trees surrounding this small yard. And folks have lived here now for a couple years. This building's maybe 10 years old or so. This is just a small place, as you can see. But uh, I have a lawn back here for their kids, you know, come, uh, come springtime. So I'm just preparing it right now, and this was just very, very heavy moss. Like I say, they've got drainage, drainage problems back here. And so between the heavy shade and between the drainage problems, the, the lawn just gets smothered, the roots rot, and all kinds of problems coming in. So I'm just coming in here, I did a little airifying, did a little thatching, prepared it, and they're, yeah, they're actually, the homeowner's going to rake up this mess, which is nice for me, saves my back and then I'll be all ready to be seeded and they are considering bringing in some more soil I told them I suggested that it's I got such a nice rip on here that's for the front yard like I say this is a smaller property but as for the front yard here I've gone over this about four times and just wanted to show you real quick what this looks like here and uh, and they're going to definitely overseed this too this is still a working project and we'll work in process. And the clients understand that too. On behalf of the Aerating and Thatching Company, I thank you for watching this video. Bye bye.